Welcome. Thank you for being here. This is a place for understanding and healing. Today we talk about something very important, how what happened to us as children can affect our grown-up relationships. Many people carry hurt from their past. It's okay not to be okay. We are here to listen and learn together. Our goal is to understand these wounds so we can start to heal. Remember, you are not alone. Let's begin this journey together with open hearts and minds. Childhood is supposed to be a time of joy, filled with laughter, play, and the carefree moments that shape our early years, and safety. But for some, it's marked by difficult experiences that cast a long shadow over their lives. These experiences can be very painful and stay with us even when we grow up. They linger in our minds, affecting our thoughts and emotions. This is what we call childhood trauma. It's a deep-seated pain that doesn't easily fade away. It's like a wound that hasn't healed. The scars may not always be visible, but they are there, influencing our lives in subtle and profound ways. It can affect how we see ourselves and the world around us. Our self-esteem, our relationships, and our ability to trust can all be impacted. Trauma can come in many forms. It could be physical, emotional, or even just witnessing something scary or hurtful. Each type leaves its own unique imprint or even just witnessing something scary or hurtful. The fear and confusion can be overwhelming, leaving a lasting impression. Whatever the form, it leaves a mark. These marks shape who we become, influencing our choices and behaviors in ways we might not even realize. Healing from childhood trauma is possible, but it often requires time, support, and understanding. Therapy, self-reflection, and connecting with others who understand can be powerful tools in this journey. It's a path of self-discovery and growth where we learn to embrace our past and find strength in our resilience. By acknowledging and addressing our trauma, we can begin to heal and create a brighter, more hopeful future for ourselves and those we love. Childhood trauma doesn't disappear when we grow up. It lingers in the corners of our minds, often unnoticed, but always present. These early experiences shape who we become, influencing our thoughts, behaviors, and emotions in profound ways. It can show up in our adult lives in many ways, especially in our relationships. The arguments we have, the misunderstandings that arise, and the feelings of isolation we experience can all be traced back to unresolved childhood issues. These moments of conflict and disconnection are often echoes of past hurts. It can be hard to trust, communicate, or be close to others. The walls we build to protect ourselves as children can become barriers in our adult relationships. We might struggle to open up, fearing rejection or judgment. This can lead to a cycle of loneliness and misunderstanding. Imagine a young boy who was always yelled at. Each shout and harsh word leaves a mark, teaching him that his voice doesn't matter. This boy grows up carrying the weight of these experiences, often without even realizing it. He might grow up afraid to speak his mind, even in a loving relationship. The fear of being yelled at again can be paralyzing, making it difficult for him to express his true feelings and needs. This hesitation can create distance and misunderstanding with those he cares about. This is just one example. Trauma affects everyone differently. Some might become overly cautious, while others might act out in anger or frustration. The ways in which we cope with our past are as varied as the experiences themselves. The important thing is to understand that these reactions are normal. They are our mind's way of protecting us from further harm. Recognizing this is the first step towards healing. Seeking help, whether through therapy, support groups, or self-help resources, can provide the tools needed to navigate these challenges. They are not your fault. The journey to healing is a personal one, but it's important to remember that you are not alone. Many have walked this path before and have found ways to overcome their past. With patience, understanding, and support, it is possible to unpack the weight of the past and move towards a brighter future. Trust is the foundation of any strong relationship, but childhood trauma can make it hard to trust others. If a child is betrayed or abandoned, they may grow up believing that everyone will hurt them. 
This can lead to pushing people away or being suspicious, even when it's not warranted. It's like building a wall around your heart to protect yourself from getting hurt again. But these walls, built for protection, can also keep love out. Speaking a different language. Communication is key in any relationship. But you know, childhood trauma can make it difficult to express our needs and feelings clearly. Imagine a girl who grew up with constant fighting at home. She might learn to bottle up her emotions to avoid conflict. This can lead to misunderstandings and frustration. It's important to remember that everyone communicates differently. Patience and understanding are crucial. The closeness that wounds. Intimacy is about feeling safe and connected to another person. But for someone who has experienced trauma, intimacy can feel scary and overwhelming. Imagine a young man who was abused as a child. He might struggle with physical touch or emotional closeness, fearing he will be hurt again. These reactions are normal. It's important to approach intimacy at your own pace and communicate your needs to your partner. Finding light in the darkness. The effects of childhood trauma can be long lasting, but there is hope. Recognizing the impact of your past is the first step towards healing and building healthier relationships. There are people who understand and can help. Therapists, support groups, and even trusted friends can offer a listening ear and guidance. You don't have to face this alone. Remember, seeking help is a sign of strength, not weakness. The courage to heal. Healing from childhood trauma is a journey, not a destination. It takes time, courage, and self-compassion. Be patient with yourself and celebrate each step you take towards healing. Therapy can provide you with tools and strategies to manage the effects of trauma. It can help you understand your emotions better and develop healthier coping mechanisms. Remember, you are worthy of love and happiness. Don't let the past dictate your future. Your journey to wholeness. Take a moment to reflect on your own experiences. Think about the moments that have shaped you, the challenges you've faced, and the triumphs you've celebrated. Each step of your journey has brought you to this point, and it's important to honor that. Have you been impacted by childhood trauma? These early experiences can leave lasting imprints on our lives, influencing our thoughts, behaviors, and relationships. It's crucial to acknowledge these impacts as the first step towards healing. Do you recognize any of the patterns we've discussed? Patterns of behavior, thought, and emotion that may have originated from past experiences? Share your experience in the comments section. Identifying these patterns is a powerful act of self-awareness and a key component of personal growth. If so, know that you are not alone. Many people share similar experiences and feelings. It's a common human experience to face struggles and seek understanding. Community and connection can provide immense support. There is help available, and you deserve to heal. Professional support, such as therapy, can offer guidance and tools to navigate your journey. Support groups can provide a sense of belonging and shared understanding. Reach out to a therapist, join a support group, or talk to someone you trust. Opening up about your experiences can be incredibly liberating and is a vital step towards healing. Remember, seeking help is a sign of strength, not weakness. Thank you for taking this journey with us today. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Remember, healing is possible. It may be a gradual process, but every step you take is a step towards wholeness. Celebrate your progress, no matter how small it may seem. You are strong, you are worthy, and you are not alone. Embrace your journey with courage and compassion. Your path to wholeness is uniquely yours, and every effort you make is a testament to your resilience and strength.